Dimitri, Dimitri Simba, he's a natural born leader. Um, someone, he's a mixed bag to be completely honest. Uh, I think the biggest part of this process for me was sort of justifying how he could care about the community so much, but at the same time play a role in, um, I mean, he's a drug dealer, you know, so it's a, it's a tough thing. It's a, it's, just, it's a tough contradiction to, to, to play, but I think there are people in the real world who, you know, are just like this guy. When we see the purge that came out in 2013, the first literal purge that came out, uh, we see that, you know, crime is at an all-time low and whatnot, so we get to go inside with this one and see how that came about. So we get to see the people who, who were responsible for creating the experiment, what their intentions were, but then also, and that much more tragically, we get to experience what it was um, for the victims of this experimentation. Naya is Dimitri's only peer in this movie. Um, Dimitri is the king of the jungle, right? But Naya, he has a lot of history with her, so there's a level of familiarity. It doesn't go much into the script, but I will believe I believe her to have been his first love, somebody who he really cared about, somebody who just knew him in a way that was a lot less guarded than he is forced to be being in his line of work these days. It doesn't sugarcoat because it gets right to the, to the root of what many people to be, believe the purge to actually be about. And um, it just, it just kind of says, hey, here's, here's something to consider. It definitely does push the boundaries. Yeah. That's why you should go see it.